The Kiel Institute is uh, betting on the new generations. We welcome you to the first full day of the second international Tomorrow's Ideas Now conference. It's a great platform that showcases our undergraduate research and it takes what we learn in our classrooms beyond the classrooms, like not only locally but it's taking it globally. opportunity to, to attend all these different sessions and, and get this massive amount of input in a short time. The opportunity to, to work on a paper like this has it's been very good for me, I think. A good experience to, to have the opportunity to do some uh, research, if that's what you call it. My experience here has been phenomenal because it's been so great to meet so many other undergraduate students who are coming to, under the same goal to share their ideas and it's, it's been amazing and not to mention Edmonton is really great. So it's great to see the city and, and to be in a different place with just your ideas, being able to share that with people and getting very raw feedback and initial reactions. And there's nothing like that um, for undergraduate students really. It's so, it's so prolonged when you get feedback. The only feedback you get is from your teachers. And you know, that's great, but it's good to get from your peers how they're processing Processing information, being able to share ideas, and it really starts the like seed for collaborative work. My goal is for my work to not just be in academia and not just be pedagogical, but to be more relatable on a public stance. And this is great for that because people who may not understand American culture or may not understand what I'm talking about specifically give me a lot of feedback on how it's perceived. So this is changing my approach as far as um, how I want to be relatable worldwide and, and how what am I saying have to do with the global economy rather than just what I've perceived in my local identity. We have that chance to come and, and uh, debate and enrich our uh, knowledge about all these important topics. I'm not young but this is my third uh, university degree and I'm doing this because Precisely, you have sometimes to go back to the roots of knowledge and you have to refresh yourself and reinvent yourself and that's what I'm trying to do because many of my old schemes or models are not working anymore in this world so I need to, to refresh the angle, the view of life and the world and uh, this kind of experiences are a uh, a testimony of, of, of this important need to, to, to refresh things constantly. I don't feel like there's a, a difference between being a presenter and a keynote because it's such a nice community and it's such a family feel that I, I don't feel any different from people who are like qualified academics to the people who are doing this for the first time and I think it's just such a lovely family feel that KIAS has. It's actually very important and helpful to create real situation that takes undergrad work out of the hypothetical situation of lectures just inside the institution and making a connection to the real world, the rest of the community. I think that's an important lesson for me. I'm so happy to have met so many people from different countries, different universities and it's been an amazing experience so far and I hope to come back next year. Doing KIAS last year definitely gave me a lot more confidence in what I wanted to do and it's definitely you know, given me the drive to apply for masters and apply for funding for certain things and, and also to look at um, universities abroad. It gives you a lot more passion and inspiration when you meet other people who have that same love of their subject. Sometimes I feel like you lose that when you're in a large university and you're in a course with like say you know a couple of hundred other people and then to finally you know find 40 people who have the absolute same passion as you is just perfect. I think it's great I wish there were more of them I wish there was more undergraduate um, support and undergraduate sort of a place that we all can talk and, and do more teamwork and do more um, collective research um, and so this is great I think it's the first step and I hope there's many more. It was exciting it was a thrill um, 
and it turned out to be a great experience. We had this, we got a very good conversation going on, with great questions coming in, so it turned out to be a good thing. To bring many more young people or fresh ideas into the academic and university debates because we have to renew constantly. So let this be for many, many, many years on and on.